A great exercise for the stomach is called single knees to chest. And so you lie down, nice and flat, and you raise with your hands up, bringing one knee into the chest, coming back down, and then you bring the other in. Or you can do like 20, 30, 40, 50, you'll definitely feel the burn. Exercises for flat stomach, burpees. Go down, out, in, up. You want to be holding your core nice and tight because as you go out and in, you'll be working your lower abs. Four sets of 25 and then you'll be puffed. Good core workout. Tap your ankles and extend out into like a dish shape and then bring the ankles back in. So you bring the feet up off the floor, make sure you're opening across the chest and the core is engaged. You're simply going to tap your ankles and then extend all the way out into a dish shape and then come back up and tap the ankles. Now that might look a little bit too far for you, but start in this position and just take it as far as you can to start with and eventually you'll get further and further until you're all the way out into that dish. Um, obviously really good not just for core stability but for kind of improving all areas of your abdominal muscles and it's good for your hip flexors and good for your back also. And I kind of say maybe do three rounds but probably only for 30 seconds of each round, have a little rest in between, because they're quite hard. One of my favorite core exercises for strengthening the abs is a lying leg raise or knee raise. You can either do this exercise with your knees or with your legs. So lay down flat, place your hands just at the top of your butt to support your lower back, arms down to the floor, and we're gonna bring our knees in towards the chest, and then extend the legs back out again. Making sure you breathe out as your knees come in. The harder version, you can either bring your legs up and towards your forehead. Slightly harder, this exercise is really great for developing strength in the lower abdominals. And if you can do three sets of 10 to 15 reps, three times a week, you'll develop a very strong midsection. Bicycle kicks is another one of my favorites. Line your back, lifting one leg up, and alternate. Trying to keep your shoulders up off the floor and touching your elbows to your knees. 20 or 30 to these. And just keeping your core tight the whole time. Do 20 to 30 repetitions, alternating each side. And then have a little rest. Try and do that five, even to 10 times. And your abs will be burning on fire. It's a great way to lose a little bit of belly fat and to tone your muscles. A really good ab one that gets forgotten because people do normal sit-ups is to do a full sit-up but with the soles of your feet placed together and your knees out to the side and you kind of disable your hip flexor in a way and that isn't there to help pull you up. So you're using less of your hip flexors and it takes more abdominal strength. And kind of do as many as you can as a finisher I'd say. Um, it's a really good way to strengthen your abdominal muscles without relying on your legs and your hip flexors to pull you up. <laughs> <laughs>